Santa Monica is a hot spot for LA tourism, but below the surface, pollution is impacting the beach's health. For Talia Walsh, the issue hits close to home. Something that I've really been passionate about my whole life is the environment. After moving out to Los Angeles 10 years ago and working in the entertainment industry, Talia decided to quit her job and devote her life to making a difference. I really wanted to pursue something I was really passionate about and use the skills that I've gained through my decade of professional experience and put them to good use. Talia joined the Heal the Bay team, a nonprofit working to protect California beaches for the past 35 years. The organization also teaches about 25,000 local youth a year at its aquarium. Talia says educating kids on keeping our beaches clean is an important responsibility. We cannot wait to see the realities that the next generation creates for us because they're going to solve many of the problems of today. One step that Heal the Bay is taking to solve the problems of today is its annual California Coastal Cleanup Day. This year, almost 14,000 people came out in Los Angeles County alone and picked up 30,000 pounds of trash in the span of three hours. The California Coastal Cleanup found that cigarettes are the number one beach contaminant over the past 30 years. Cigarette butts make up 37% of the beach's trash. It's really disheartening to walk down uh, one of your favorite beaches and to see trash. And it's something I think that we all experience. It's definitely something that Kathy Carrasco experiences, and it's why she brings her daughter to Heal the Bay Aquarium. She, she loves the sea creatures, and she knows that they're living, so I want her to grow up learning to protect them and help keep everything clean so that the animals can still be around when she gets older. By hosting events and educating kids, Talia hopes that Heal the Bay will spark lifelong advocacy. When you're picking up your 10th cigarette butt, you're starting to really recognize the problem and a pattern of behavior that needs to be changed. And so once you see that, you can't unsee it. According to Talia, the actions of today hold significant weight in impacting the future of our oceans. The sooner we can fix the problem, the better. For Annenberg Media, I'm Brogan Craner.